with a kind of a haul video in case you're not aware I think you probably will because I put up a vlog already hopefully you watched it and enjoyed it um, I was in Dublin recently at a big huge huge Irish YouTuber gathering for the Irish Creators Day up in Google headquarters if you're interested in seeing my vlog for that um, I will link in the description box. I've actually also created a playlist in case you're in interested too of everyone else's vlogs. It was an absolutely amazing day. But today I'm going to show you some of the shopping I've done while I was in Dublin. In case people don't know, I'm actually from Cork. So um, I think some people kind of presume that I'm from... I'm not sure why they presume, but I'm not from Dublin. Um, why would you think that with my big Cork accent? Anyway, so while I was up in the big smoke, um, I took advantage and went to some of the shops that aren't available to us here in Cork. So I'm going to quickly jump into what I'm going to show you, which is the stuff that I bought. Okay, starting off in a shop that's not available anywhere else in Ireland is a space in K. I was so, so excited to go here. Um, you'll see my vlog. I was very excited. I'm not sure if I filmed inside there or not. But inside here I just got one thing. I was looking at um, getting a few things but I kind of held back my money because I planned on getting something else that I didn't end up getting. I'm blabbing. So what I got in Space and K was this. This is the Dr. Lip Original Nip Nipple Balm for Lips. Okay. Don't shy away. Don't X out. I'm not using it on my nipples. It's for your lips. It's a really, really intense moisturising treatment for your lips. Um, so I'll show you a bit a quick um, up close there now. Okay, so this is what it looks like. It comes in a big tube like this. There's actually quite a lot of product in here. Well, it looks like there's 15 mils of product in here and it's just a screw top. I'm not sure if I'll go in depth, but um, it's sealed as you can see I haven't used it yet. But basically that's what it looks like up close. Um, this is raved about and it's people are kind of freaked. Ooh, I'm not in focus. Wait a sec. Okay, so as I was saying, this is raved about. It's basically a cult product for your lips. It's hugely moisturising. Um, I'm not sure the history behind it was it actually meant to be a nipple balm. I assume it was because the name is on it for moisturising the nips. Um, Dr. Lip is a global cult beauty balm for soothing dry cracked skin. So basically I think this is kind of a dupe for or kind of along the same lines as Elizabeth Arden 8 Hour Cream. Multi-purpose for really really dry parts of your body but I'm going to use on my lips. So I got that in Space and K. That was 14 euro. So I'm really really excited to try that out because I'm obsessed with lip stuff. Um, that's all I got in the, there. I think it is. Yeah. So the next place we went to was MAC. Now obviously MAC is available to me in Cork so there's no excuse but I did buy some products in there so I'll show you. Um, okay so I got two lipsticks and I, the first colour I got was Diva. I was looking for a really really deep dark brick red blacky browny red kind of colour. Um, ended up going for Diva so I'll show you that up close now. Okay so there it is up close. It kind of looks like nothing. It's kind of hard to show but I may as well swatch it for you while I'm here. So as you can see there it's just a really really deep deep brick So I'm really kind of really excited to try that. It's just really really deep venomous kind of red colour. So that's Diva. Okay so the next colour I got is called Honey Love and I'm not sure if this is going to swatch very well because it's actually kind of a nudie kind of colour but I'll try and show you there. These are such professional swatches. But you can basically see it's kind of an orangey nudie beige kind of colour. So that is called Honey Love. I hope you can kind of see there, those are the two colours that I went for are completely different and I'm really excited to try those out. Um, okay, the next place we went is actually Makeup Forever. Um, myself, Monster Makeup, and Monster Makeup XX and Riona Cahill, we all had Grab One vouchers for Makeup Forever. Um, really, really good deal. We went in to get the makeup or the the HD foundation which they were completely out of stock so she actually ended up giving me a sample I'm in the colour HD 110 which is basically the very lightest you can get so I just got a sample of this but um yeah it's not going to be very interesting to show you but I we did call in there and I'm actually the I just got a phone call to say they just got it in so that's on its way now to me so yeah okay next place we went to was Inglot um and in there I purchased a powder I don't Okay, sorry about that, I actually just got interrupted. My mother came with my two nieces and they were gushing over Bulmer. Anyway, long story short. Um, yeah, next I was just about to tell you we went to Inglot and I got a powder and I'm just after realising I can't actually tell what number this is. I thought the number was going to be in the back of it but it turns out you can buy these separate. But basically this is, um, what does it say it here? Freedom System Palette Round Gloss, no. Um, anyway, I got a bronzer. Well, kind of a, it's like a matte bronzer. I kind of got this for just warming up my face, not necessarily contouring, although I probably could, it's kind of, and it's a little bit, 
well it looks very orange tone there but um yeah basically just a matte kind of bronzer for um warming up my face so i got that that's very handy actually it comes with the mirror so i'll try and find out what color that is but for now that's what i got in english and that's kind of all the beauty products actually i'll quickly cheat and tell you what i got in lloyd's um just yesterday because there's actually an offer on at the moment and may as well just show you while i'm here because these are new products too and um, the first thing i got oh i actually got this to go with my honey love um lipstick this is from rimmel it's a lip liner in the color 018 addiction and i kind of got it hoping that this would go well this is handy now it's my first time seeing what they're going to look like beside each other and I'll make it work. It looks a bit pinkier than Honey Love does, but I kind of wanted one that was going to be darker than Honey Love so I could kind of overline my lips a little bit or try and make them more 3D or what's try and give them a bit more depth. So that there it is there. So it's a bit lighter and it's a bit more pink toned, but we'll see how that goes. Um basically the two products I wanted to tell you about was it's a trilogy offer. It's my first time trying trilogy. Um, but there's an offer on at the moment that if you buy any moisturiser you get a free cleanser with it and it's a 100ml cleanser, it's a full size cleanser so it's the cream cleanser, soft smooth, completely clean skin with rose hip evening primrose, primrose carrot um, but basically yes I got this for completely for free when you buy a moisturiser um, let's see can I open it for you okay so it comes in yeah just the typical trilogy I'm after messing up my nail ah. The typical um, Trilogy packaging, we basically got this for free because I bought a moisturiser. Let me see what it smells like. Oh, okay, there's a silver foil in it so I can't tell what it smells like. Um, anyway, this is the product I purchased to get my freebie. This is the Rosapene, R-O-S-A-P-E-N-E, Rosapene um, Night Cream with Advanced Natural, oh no, with Rosapene, Goji and Manuka Honey. I saw this one, the winner in the Best of Beauty 2014 and I wanted a good night cream when it comes to skincare I'm trying to buy better products and especially at night time because I feel like that's when your skin starts to re rejuvenate itself is that the right word just kind of building itself and lose all it loses lipids during the day and it's whatever just to work its magic at night time so I want to buy a good um, value and good quality night product so this is what I bought um, it is quite luxurious looking glass frosted jar and it comes with this little spatula which I most likely probably won't be using um, but there's all sorts of goodness inside here it has, I'm not like 100% on the kind of smell that comes off it I'm nearly sure there's some sort of lavender in here which I don't like but I don't mind really when it comes to night care like, well, night care skincare at night time it's just kind of, I suppose lavender is for night I'm not even sure if there's lavender in this, I'm yabbing Basically, yeah, that was an offer. This is kind of priced at, thir I think it was 29.99. So yeah, that's how much that was. Been in the pricey side, but I did get my free full size product. Full size product with that. Um, this video is gonna be so long. Moving on to some of the clothes and stuff that I bought, I went to Forever 21, which again is only in um, Dublin. I'll kind of try and fly through this because I know this video is getting long. I picked up these, these are really cute, these are just makeup sponges, they were 5 dollars and I thought this would be really handy for foundation and this one looks really really cute for like under the eye patting and concealer. Then I got some jewellery, there's such a nice array of jewellery in there. Sorry if I'm being really loud. I can't even remember what I got. Oh yeah, this is the first thing I got, which is actually looking a bit tangled. But you kind of, you get the idea, it's just a really nice layering piece and it has all, it's kind of like this kind of boho theme going on. It has all the brown and green beads and it has some of the gold studs. So it is gold. That's I'm just I forgot I got this. This was $7.95. So I thought that'd be just a really nice kind of layering piece for wearing with the clothes that I got, which I will show you now in a second. And then I think I got another chain. Oh I got two more things. Oh yeah I forgot I got these as well. <laughs> okay this is the other chain that I got which was only four euro and again it's just this kind of simple double layered long necklace and it has loads of these small little discs okay so you hopefully you can kind of see there it just has loads of these little small little mini discs on it and i thought that'd be really nice again with kind of what i bought so that's the jewelry that was only four euros so that's really um good value which is what i'm after when it comes to clothes okay stuff. so next i got just a bit of silver because i'm actually more of a silver person than gold even though i bought more gold just these earrings these are really cool actually the um, again, I okay, so as close. you can see there, your like the whole of your ear 
or <laughs> how do I say this? Like you put this part here into the hole of your ear and then this part is just gonna hang out. So it's just gonna look like a kind of a half hoop on the front and then no hoop on the back, which is ironic because I'm actually be wearing big huge hoops today. I feel like I'm really afraid of hoops, which is why I bought these because they're half hoops, but then I ironically I'm wearing full massive big huge hoops today, which I definitely would not wear with my hair up because I'd feel too like, eh, look at my ears. <laughs> Okay, anyway, those were three euros. So those are really kind of um, different to anything else I own, bar the fact that I'm wearing hoops. Anyway, never mind, three euro bargain bought them. Okay, then onto the clothes that I bought. These jeans I got in Forever 21. Kind of funny because I actually bought another pair of jeans that were way more expensive, which I'll show you in a minute. Okay, these were 14.95, and they're basically just denim skinnies. Um, I hope you'll be, be able to see these now properly. Well, not it's not very exciting. They're just kind of skinnies, but they just fitted really well. And they, I like they have the zip and the buckle as opposed to not having anything, just having the elastic, which annoys me because I feel like I need a belt to keep like pants up. So that's what those are. And they're what I really liked about them is that they are actually really skinny to the to the bottom so they're skinny all the way down as opposed to being skinny and then being a bit out of the bottom. So you can actually wear these. I don't like my jeans being big going into my boots. I like them to be stuck to me going into my boots. Do you know what I'm trying to say? Um, so yeah, got those. These are the high rise, those are the high rise skinnies. So for 14.95, what an absolute bargain. So I was really happy with those. And they're a really nice dark denim color. Then the top that I got, I'm really happy with as well. I kind of want to lighten up my wardrobe a little bit. This is a cardigan. Let's see which way it goes. Basically it's just a cream open cardigan. It goes right down, kind of covers your bum and has a kind of like a three quarter length sleeve, but it's really slouchy and cuddly and warm and soft. It's just really, really nice. This was 21.75 and I got the size medium. Um, yeah, just really, really nice and comfy and cozy. And I feel like this would go really well with the skinny jeans, maybe with a, like a brown top or a cream top underneath a scarf and boots and just be really nice and cozy. So yeah, that was that. Okay, that's all I got in Forever 21, but I could have spent the day in there, but we actually ended up being thrown out because the shop is closing and I was like, oh, I want everything. Anyway, I was very happy with that. Next, oh, these are some of my Google stuff. I forgot this was in here. I just bought something in Google. May as well show you. Oh, oh, here's my badge. Oh, good times. This is my badge that I got from Google, as you can see. Hello, my name is Laura. That is my name. So this is the kind of the lanyard that we're wearing. Stuff. I forgot that was in there. It's going to be a really nice thing to keep. Um, I got this notepad and a pen saying YouTube. I'm so, so happy I got this. It was 10 euro, which is like a bit ridiculous because it's just a plain notepad. But it's just fancy and it's just, it says YouTube and I, I just kind of had to buy it. So I'm going to be writing some of my video ideas in there. And I really am. I always kind of say this and buy notepads and say I'm going to write lists and do this kind of thing. But I really am because this is my dedicated YouTube book. Okay, finally, I went to River Island and I bought what Grace basically told me to buy. Not told me to buy, but I saw her mentioning it on Facebook or somewhere like that, or on Instagram, she's done out, out for the day. And these are the famous tube pan pants from River Island. I got them in black. Ooh, doorbell. Okay, I was yet again interrupted. It was the Coleman that time. Very fascinating. Basically, I got these tube pants. I have to stop saying basically. Um, I got the tube pants and these, she said they were just super, super comfortable, that they were really stretchy, even though they're kind of jean material. They're not jean material, but they kind of look like jeans. And then she said they just, they fit really well like a glove and they come high rise, which I'm all about because I can't stand pants that are too low. And again, they're just really tight, really stick to you. The lady, the shop assistant in there told me to go a size down, which I was really, really scared to do. And now I definitely should have. I actually ended up getting, I bought a 14, which I am normally. I should have gotten the 12. Um, so I might see, can I exchange these? Because, yeah, I should have went with the 12. So these are called the Tube Pants, super skinny, high rise. Um, got the, those in black, they're 40 euro. So that's the big difference between Forever and 21 and River Island. So maybe I'll, I'm not sure what to do, whether to keep one or to return one or... Is there going to be a huge difference between a 40 euro pair and 15 euro pair? I don't know, we'll see. So that's, oh, got one more thing, which I forgot to give to Cahill. I bought these for Cahill. These are the M&M's birthday cake flavor. They were two euro, what was I thinking? But uh, so I'll give those to him. 
this video is so long, I'm so sorry. I must be kind of hyper, I think I've drank too much coffee. Thank you so much for watching. I was really, really happy with everything I bought and I'm very lucky and yeah, I just feel happy. Um, thank you for watching. Sorry it's so long. See you in my next one. Bye.